As days passes by, we are slowly recovering from the havoc created by the second wave of COVID-19. Tens of thousands of people have lost their lives in the second wave of COVID-19, as per reports. However, there have been many other deaths which still remains unreported. And frankly speaking, those numbers are quite high. The interesting fact about the second wave of COVID-19 is that it was triggered by the highly contagious Delta variant, which was found in India last year. And most of the deaths which occurred during the second phase of COVID-19 was mostly due to the Delta variant. While we are slowly making our way back to normalcy, new cases of infections are coming to surface, with even higher transmissible and concerning impact. In these cases, it seems that the Delta variant, which was the root cause of the second wave of COVID-19, has improvised itself and mutated into a new strain, which is more transmissible and infectious in nature. This new strain of COVID-19 has been named the Delta Plus variant. Doctors and medical professionals are quite concerned about the Delta Plus variant and fears that it might lead to the third wave of COVID-19 in India. Till the 30th of June, a total of 56 cases of Delta Plus variant across 13 states have been registered in India. The states include Madhya Pradesh, Maharashtra, Punjab, Gujarat, Kerala, Andhra Pradesh, Tamil Nadu, Urisha, Rajasthan, Jammu Kashmir, Karnataka, Haryana, and recently in Himachal Pradesh. So far, three deaths have been reported, one from Tamil Nadu and two from Maharashtra. In this video, we will try to understand about the Delta Plus variant of COVID-19, its first detection. Why is it so dangerous? Symptoms associated with it. Causes and concerns. Precautions to take and treatment. What is Delta Plus variant? Delta Plus variant is the mutated version of the Delta variant, which wreaked havoc in India during the last few months of COVID-19. Basically, the mutation allows the Delta variant to acquire a spike protein mutation, forming a variant which is scientifically known as AY1 variant. This mutation helps the COVID-19 virus to enter and infect the human cells. Origin of the Delta Plus variant The Delta Plus variant was first detected in Europe in the month of March 2021. Later, it was found in other countries such as USA, UK, Portugal, Switzerland, Japan, Poland, Nepal, China, Russia, and India. Delta Plus variant was first identified in India on June 11. What makes the Delta Plus variant dangerous? The Delta Plus variant mainly contains multiple mutations in the spike protein. As a result, the spike protein becomes as such that it becomes more efficient in attaching itself to the host cells in the human body and multiplies swiftly, thus invading the human immune system and affecting the organs, doing more damage to the body 
than the original COVID-19 virus strain. Hence, the Delta Plus variant has been declared as a virus of concern or VOC. What are the concerns over the Delta Plus variant? One of the rising concerns is over the transmissibility rate being higher than the other strains. Also, experts are afraid that it may show resistance against treatments which are being used for Delta variants. Apart from this, one of the major concerns being that the new variant may be able to bypass the immunity provided by the vaccine. Are the vaccines effective against the Delta Plus variant? The cases detected so far are quite low. Studies are still going on. However, as of now, there is no clear evidence which shows the effectiveness of vaccines against the Delta Plus variant. Symptoms of Delta Plus variant Studies and research are still going on in finding the symptoms of the new variant or to find if there is any difference in symptoms in comparison with their predecessor. As per preliminary reports, the symptoms are dry cough, fever, tiredness, pains, skin rashes, toes and fingers discoloration, sore throat, conjunctivitis, loss of taste and smell, diarrhea, headache and chest pain, speech loss, stomach ache, nausea, appetite loss and vomiting, joint pains, hearing impairment. Precautions to take Maintain good hygiene, both oral and physical cleanliness. Maintaining proper social distance. Wearing double mask is a must. Avoid dusty areas and dust. Keep washing your hands regularly with soap and use sanitizer. Gurgle with warm water regularly. Take steam every day if possible. Drink warm water. Take care of your diet. Do breathing exercises as well as others to stay fit. Treatments available Dedicated treatment against Delta Plus variant is yet to be ascertained as the variant is quite recently discovered and the cases related to it is few. The Delta Plus variant is still an unknown virus as of now. Researches and studies are still on about the Delta Plus strain. So it would be better for us whether we have taken vaccines or not to be extra precautious as we don't really know how it could affect us and our dear ones through us. So stay home, stay safe.